This is one happy and healthy baby possum. Unfortunately, Augustus at this point thinks I'm his mother. But Augustus, named after the month he was rescued from a roadside accident that killed his mum, is one of the lucky ones. We have seen the busiest spring we've ever seen in the organisation's 35-year history. In September was a 52% increase in incoming calls from the public. The warmer than usual start to spring has resulted in an early breeding season, meaning more movement and road accidents. Springtime is baby time, uh, so there's lots of young animals that have either been displaced uh, or their mum's been injured or sick, so they're orphaned. Uh, this year in particular, though, has been next level of springtime. It's been exacerbated by bushfires, floods and fierce winds. This baby magpie was found just before the AFL Grand Final near the MCG after being blown out of its nest and it proves wildlife injuries are far from a country problem. 75% of all call-outs come from Metro Melbourne. We're encroaching on wildlife's habitat more and more, so therefore we see them around our more suburban areas, even in our city areas now, so everywhere there's wildlife. So what should you do if you hit a kangaroo on the road or you find an abandoned animal in your suburban driveway? Well, the first things first is make sure you're OK and stay away from the animal until you get some advice. Call Wildlife Victoria for advice. They're available 24-7. And if they say you can handle the animal, you can. And if they say you should take it to the vet, don't be afraid that you'll be stuck with the bill either. Vets do treat wildlife for free. Animal experts are also urging people to think of wildlife over what could be a scorching summer by leaving water out on hot days and planting more natives. Even on your city balcony, because with all of the habitat destruction and urbanisation, native vegetation is food for our wildlife. The MCG Maggie will be returned to where it was found once it can fly. Augustus, however, needs several more months of care before being released. Iskandar Razak, ABC News.